orchestrating the offense. Murray with five to shoot. Spins, up and under, forced it short, and good defense by Watford completes the defensive possession. Wiles leave it, Sabonis spins, lost it, turnover. Thomas, Euros, corkscrew, no, follow, yes. Trend in Watford running the floor. Kings run the last four minutes of action. The Nets led 15 to 10 with four and a half to play in the quarter. Uh, work for a good one here, five to shoot for Watford, working on Len, has to float it up and in. Nicely done, body control from Watford. You know, my last year in Denver, I had the opportunity to play with Trey Lyles and to see his growth, to see his development over the last few years. I've been so impressed with him and also happy to see his professionalism. Right Watford goes in and gets that leg, finds the role and the team that he can excel with. Watford couldn't get the angle there. Up ahead for Jones, attacking on Bridges. Sharp throw on the play, kick it. Ellis hits the three. So to instill that into some of your young players, I think is a good idea. Thomas drives, cut off. Wilson was left alone initially. Swing it, Watford, three ball, and it's right there. I they sent him the gift card, yeah. Yeah, that's what I, I know that. I'm looking for more than a gift card. I think it's like a check <laughs> yeah. is what you should be looking at. With but. a lot of commas, right? Yeah. <laughs> Watford from deep, he's starting to eat a little bit. The bonus is so much stronger than I think people give him credit for. He's got 12 points, still nine rebounds. Watford in a crowd, can't get the roll. There's the 10th rebound in his 61st consecutive double-double. And you're just, and, and like, De'Aaron, what are you talking about? You're saying you'd a delay of game doesn't cost you anything, but giving them and allowing a team to have a three or something, four on five, hurts you. So that, to me... De'Aaron Sharp gets the run here in this third quarter. Watford lost it, got it to Thomas, a lot of space, cash, Cam from deep. Walker, kick it, Watford, a three, short, rebound, short, vacuums it in, couldn't finish, Watford over the top, and a chaotic sequence ends with Sacramento grabbing the ball. Walker, kick it, Watford, a three, short, rebound, short, vacuums it in, couldn't finish, Watford over the top. And a chaotic sequence ends with Sacramento grabbing the ball. My time with the Nets before we get deep in this fourth quarter and working together. If Ian isn't available, if Ryan isn't available, if Michael Grady isn't available, wow, okay. you're the person I want to work with. Whoa! The Nets' approach has been better. Obviously, the Sacramento Kings have played a very good game thus far, but ultimately, they're going to need that fourth quarter like they had against Detroit. 12 to shoot now for Watford. Back down on Murray. Likes the matchup. And can't get the roll. Tip in goes. Dayron Sharp sticking with it. Well, Clowney rips off the warm up. We'll check in next day ball. Bonus 16, 16, and 9. Thomas, he has all the angles. Against the Nets, was here in this building March 16th last year as Clowney spins away from the closeout of Fox. And then Watford had it blocked inside. That's going to be King's possession either way. Sabonis has 18, 18, and 9. As Walker driving kick. Watford lines up the three. And that foul is staying here. Sabonis is going to get called for. Watford with the acrobatic attempt. Couldn't finish it. Fox in transition. He'll pull. Oh, boom. The air and Fox feeling it from downtown. We haven't seen a lot of the kill bridges. There's a reason. At some point in time, you're going to see the Kings pull their guys. I wonder how much long Mike Brown is going to go with this lineup. It's the largest deficit of the night for Brooklyn. Right. Short lived as Watford gets to the rim. Just a couple, and now the bench starts to clear a little bit for Sacramento. Watford circles. Oh, he bends that one through. Tough delivery. The push shot goes.